What's up you guys? This is Anna. I know it has been a while. Anyways, I hope that you all are doing absolutely amazing. I know I've been a little bit MIA here in YouTube, but um, you know what to say, better late than never. So today's video, as you can already tell by the title, I'm going to show you guys how to achieve a flawless foundation with the new Filter First Foundation by Laura Giller that I have it right here actually this right here is a flawless fundamentals four piece collection that Laura Geller is coming out with this August 21st on QVC if you're interested in seeing what we're gonna get how we are gonna achieve this amazing look with these products right here just keep on watching and yeah I know right now I got no makeup on my face I'm cara lavada so you guys can actually see the difference between my actual skin and when we apply the foundation but first I'm gonna do my eyes and my brows because you guys know me I do that first and then I move on to foundation so let me do that real quick and then I'll be right back okay all right guys I'm back so as you can see I didn't go crazy at all on the eyes it's just because I really want to showcase my skin now we're gonna talk about the main attraction of this video the Laura Geller Flawless Fundamentals 4 Piece Collection. I don't know if you guys know this, but Laura Geller just launched their Filter First Luminous Foundation a few weeks back. I have tried it already and I am obsessed with it. <laughs> they also came out with a new concealer, which I'm going to be showing it to you guys as well today in this video. Um, it's not included in the kit, but I think that I should still show it to you because, I mean, why not? What we're going to do now is we're going to open our box. And I'm going to show you the goodies. Right here. Comes with the mascara, the foundation, this is a lipstick, and the brush. These three products right here are going to be limited edition only. So I will definitely suggest you guys get your hands on them because... Yeah, they are not going to last forever. Now I'm going to read what it says over here, just so you know a little bit more of it. It says, it's a hashtag no filter neither after blending on our pearl infused light diffusing filter first and luminous foundation. Powered by Island Smooth technology, the foundation creates the perfect canvas for your most effortlessly radiant look. Which I'm all for it. You know guys. We all want that. So of course it comes with the Laura Geller Filter First Law. It's a little bit confusing. Filter First Luminous Foundation. I'm in the shade medium right here. Now it also comes with the color luster lip color cranberry crush which is this really pretty color right here i don't know if you guys can see it right there now we also got the glam lash dramatic voluminizing mascara in color black this one right here i do like the wand because it's really thin and it actually helps to grab my teeny tiny lashes and last but not least, we have this Moving Foundation Blender, which is this one right here. It comes with the, you know, the blender over here. It, it does have a few tips here. It says a lot of tips on how to use the Smoothing Foundation Blender like a pro. It says wet the blender before use. Apply the foundation by stippling the flat side, which is this one right here. The flat side of the blender along the skin. All right, so like this. Uh, apply with a light hand. And the blender can also be used to buff away makeup mistakes like mascara smudge or running eyeliner. Oh, all right. All right, so I already applied my primer and I've been a lot into hydrating primers lately. I don't know why, but I feel like my skin looks way better that way when I apply hydrating primers instead of applying more of like matte finish primers or like silicone based primers, I don't know why. And now we're gonna apply a little bit of this foundation. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna apply one side of my face so you guys can actually see the difference between no makeup and foundation on. The formula is amazing. So anyways, let's just move on to the good stuff here. So something that I've been a lot into lately is what I do. I apply a few pumps on my skin and then with my fingers I start rubbing it all over the face just to kind of cover a little bit more and then with a sponge, with a brush or with whatever that you use I start blending it in just like this 
and I am doing what Laura said that we should do just using the flat side of the brush and I start stippling in like this look at that <gasps> I'm gonna get close so you guys can see how luminous and amazing my skin looks like look at that holy I just really like how it looks on the skin and the best thing ever is that you do not actually feel like you have something on so you can tell the difference now no foundation yes foundation look at just the glow that it gives to your skin it does not feel heavy at all it has a nice coverage and then look at my other side of the face definitely it looks a little bit uh, lighter than this side because obviously you can tell that I am like tan and trying to match my face to my body now I'm gonna be honest and I thought I was not gonna like this I don't know why but surprisingly I do like it I do I I do like this punch so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna apply the other side of my face some more foundation so yeah Ooh. oh my god I'm so obsessed with this foundation it looks so pretty let me just get this close to you guys so you guys can see how it actually looks on the skin like so pretty so pretty me encanta all right so as i already said the filter first luminous concealer is not included in the kit but i still wanted to show it to you guys just so you guys could see how it works and how it looks on the skin this is the packaging and yeah so I, this is in the shade uh, medium, if I am not mistaken. Yes, definitely. You just do this and apply it. To blend this concealer, I'm going to be using this uh, brush, um, sponge brush. I want to see if, if it actually helps to blend the concealer as nice as it did with the foundation, which I feel like it does. I do not have a lighter uh, color on this concealer. I just have this color right here. I don't know why I forgot to grab a lighter one the day of the uh, brunch that we had with Laura Geller, which it was amazing by the way. I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, but if you do, probably you already saw it. It was a few weeks back. I got to meet Laura Geller, like Laura. And she was the sweetest woman ever. She was so amazing and so humble that I'm impressed like I did not think that there could be such humble people in this world she's so humble it's just she has a nice vibe I don't know how to explain it but it's something about her it's just ah so peaceful this is how it is looking right now and I love it it looks good it looks beautiful, it looks like my skin, it doesn't look like I have a pounds and pounds of makeup on. I love it. I absolutely love it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this concealer and I'm going to move on to bronzer, blush, highlight and all of that. So uh, we can move on to the uh, rest of the products that we have in the kit which is the mascara and the lipstick. So yes, I'll be right back. We are back. Apply blush, bronzer highlight I also set my makeup with some spray just to make sure that nothing moves and it stays right there now we can move on to our next two products from the Laura Geller flawless fundamentals kit and it is the glam lash dramatic volumizing mascara and then we have the Laura Geller New York um, cranberry crush lipstick this is one coat you guys let me get close to you just so you guys can see how that looks this is with some mascara and this is not mascara I'm gonna apply a second coat I think I like this yeah it looks good and I feel like this actual makeup right here that I have on right now looks absolutely good for an everyday look now we're gonna move on to lips and this is the cranberry crush So, I 
I actually really like this color. Obviously, I think I have definitely have some more uh, pigmentation. If you apply a lot more, you see that um, you can add more layers, so the color looks a little bit more rich. But I definitely prefer to stay in the more natural side. And this is the final look. Here we are. We are looking flawless with the filter first luminous foundation just like they said that we were gonna look i love it i'm obsessed with it it looks amazing uh but yeah what do you guys think i absolutely love it i feel like this is an amazing kit and if you guys really want to get your hands on this beauty right here do not forget you can get it on august 21st i will be leaving the link right below in the description box so you guys can go check it out i promise you i love it the foundation is absolutely amazing i love it i'm obsessed i have already said this like 20 million times but it is the truth how flawless does that look And now that we are done with this video, I just want to say thank you so much for watching it. And also thank you so much to the Laura Geller team for the opportunity to partner up for this video. You guys know I love you. I love the brand. So I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget that I also have an Instagram. It's me, Doanna. If you want to go follow me over there and just see a little bit more about me, my life, and more about makeup and all that kind of stuff, go check it out. Yeah, I love you all so, so, so much. Con todo mi corazón y los veré muy pronto. Bye.